my good friend Sarah Grieb, we were talking the other day and she said, you know, the more that I am working with people that are stuck or feel stuck, it seems to me that stuckness is a combination of stubbornness plus selfishness. And it was such a great frame. I've been thinking about that quite a bit in the areas where I feel stuck and maybe it's supportive for you in the areas you feel stuck. Where are you just plain old being stubborn, completely unwilling? to look at another perspective, uh, try something new, take a risk, and how much of it is connected to selfishness? You're comfortable, you like what you like, you don't wanna be uncomfortable, you don't wanna give, it's not fair, they didn't do this, they should, blah, blah, blah. So it's all those shoulds and frustrations and uh, just blame that gets wound up and helps keep us stuck in places that I think we were probably intended to move, to be adaptable. We are designed for movement and adaptability in every single aspect of our life, not just our bodies, our breath, our spirit, our brain itself is malleable. And so why not our relationships? Why not our attitudes? Why not the way that we live life every day with each other?